ties between China and Latin America are hugely mutually beneficial and sure to get stronger, according to banker and expert at the World Economic Forum Latin America opened in Buenos Aires on April 6. La influencia de China y sus relaciones son cada vez más fuertes con América Latina, ya dejó de ser solamente un comprador de materias primas, se ha constituido en un inversionista importante en América Latina y vemos también que empresas chinas como Huawei, Alibaba, van eh, tomando mucho más protagonismo en los mercados latinoamericanos. For the past decade, China has imported large quantities of natural resources, raw materials and agricultural products from Latin American countries, which played an indispensable role in China's rapid economic growth. Yeah, the new normality in China is that growth uh, will be slower, however, it will further you know, focus on the quality of growth and technology. And as I mentioned on the panel, the other element of the new normality for everyone in the world is uh, technology that brings us you know, all much closer to each other. Though China's growth in infrastructure has slowed down, it has accumulated capital for which it is seeking opportunities, and this can help create local opportunities, such as jobs and markets, as well as manufacturing to help local people, according to the banker. One is a really think like a local. You come here and then you just do business locally, so that's one. And second is a learn Spanish. And third is employ more local people. China stands as the region's second largest trading partner and third largest source of investment, while Latin America is China's seventh largest trading partner.